As I hope most of you already know, tonight was the season premiere of The Walking Dead. Now, I hope you watched it and enjoyed it because it was a really good episode. But I want to take this chance tonight to encourage everybody to watch it again. And there's a very specific reason why I want to encourage people to watch it again. Now, there is a training technique that I feel very strongly about, and I have talked about it before in videos. But because of some comments I got on some recent videos, I feel like I need to talk about it again. Now, in my recent videos I did about my clearing bucket, I had a lot of people come on and say, well, I really don't need a clearing bucket because I would never pull the trigger of my carry gun inside my home. And to these people, I always responded, well, you mean other than when you're dry firing, right? And usually they would say, no, I don't dry fire. I would never pull the trigger of my carry gun in my house, period. Now, I don't know if they're just saying this to defend their first statement and they just didn't think it through, or they really mean it and they actually don't dry fire their weapon. And if you don't dry fire your weapon, I think you're doing yourself a great disservice when it comes to training. Now, I'm not the kind of person that tells you to go out and take all kinds of training and become some kind of Rambo, but I think dry firing your weapon is essential. And a great time to do it is when you're watching a show like The Walking Dead. Just take out your carry gun and then just start picking off zombies. You know, it's a really great way to practice pulling the trigger on your gun. And if you ask me, dry firing is the best way to develop the muscle memory you need to use your gun properly in a stressful situation. So you have to dry fire your weapon. Now, a lot of people will say to me though, won't that damage my gun? Well, no, unless your gun is a rim fire, 22, it will not damage it. You can dry fire a center fire gun, all you want won't hurt it. If you're really worried about it, get some snap caps, but otherwise, don't worry about it. Because like I said, you need to do that training. You need to develop the muscle memory of using your trigger properly. And I know we all don't like training. Training is sometimes boring for some of us. Some people love it, some people don't. So that's why I say, make it fun. Watch a show like The Walking Dead, fire away at the zombies. Now I don't suggest you do it with your uh, significant other or your friends, whatever, because you're either gonna frighten them or annoy them or make them you know, think you're crazy. So just wait till you're alone, watch it again and fire away. So like I said, make a game out of it and get some really essential training. If you ask me, that's the best advice I can give you. real day.